I can say at this point that there are compelling indications that this practice did occur on a very limited scale and that a small number of individuals were killed for the purpose of extracting and trafficking their organs. In order to prosecute such offenses, however, it requires a level of evidence that we have not yet secured. Like Dick Marty during the course of his investigation, we have encountered significant challenges in obtaining such evidence. This is not to say that this evidence will not come together, and we certainly continue to vigorously pursue it. Information compiled by SITF indicates that certain elements of the KLA intentionally targeted the minority population with acts of persecution that included unlawful killings, abductions, enforced disappearances, illegal detentions in camps in Kosovo and Albania, sexual violence, other forms of inhumane treatment, forced displacement of individuals from their homes and communities, and desecration and destruction of churches and other religious sites. We believe that the evidence is compelling that these crimes were not the acts of rogue individuals acting on their own accord, but rather that they were conducted in an organized fashion and were sanctioned by certain individuals in the top levels of the KLA leadership. The widespread or systematic nature of these crimes in the period after the war ended in June 1999 justifies a prosecution for crimes against humanity. Izvešta je dobro izbalansiran, veoma oprezan. On zapravo otkriva koliko je teško preći put do istine o zločinima na Kosovo i Metohiji. Ovim izveštajem i ovim procesom su samo oškrinuta vrata međunarodne pravde za srpske žrtve na Kosovo i Metohiji. Ja se nadam da će prava istina, da će sud koji tek treba se formira imati snage da dopre do prave istine, jer bez prave istine nema ni trajnog mira u ovom regionu. Pa ja mogu samo da kažem da sam veoma zadovoljan. Mislim da je izveštaj gospodine Vidjansona krajnje objetivan, profesionalan. Sad se potvrdilo da je on odolao bilo kakvim eventualnim pritisima političkih, što je najvažnije. Zadovoljan sam upravo zbog toga što je ovo jedna kruna na naš rad. Čeka se osnivanje tog specijalnog suda za Kosovo, koji bi trebalo početkom godine da se osnovi i da radi u Holandiji. Sad vidjet ćemo nakon toga kako će to kako će da se koncipira optužnica, to me zanima, da li će u njoj biti neko optuženje i za trgovina organima.